Hello loves, if you're visiting from the other channels, thank you for stopping by and welcome to Bree's Project Book. If you are new to the family, welcome, welcome. And if you are a BPB family member, welcome back. Today we have a treat for you with another Fab Collab. The title of this Fab Collab is the Seasonal Coffee Beverage Bar Collaboration. Our hosts are Kimberly from Diva Designing on the Dime and Kenya from Kenya's Decor Corner. This collab is held every season. The rules are simple. Style your coffee or beverage station for the season. The hashtag must be in the description box. The hashtag is Summer Coffee Beverage Bar Collab. 2020. Remember to follow collab etiquette. Mention hosts in video. Have playlists listed in description. Be a subscriber to all host channels and have each host channel link in description box. This is an open collaboration so don't forget to visit the other talented YouTube sisters who are participating in the playlist below. You are invited to subscribe to their channels and give a thumbs up. It doesn't cost anything. So let's get started. So we're going to do a overview first so you can look at my coffee or cocoa bar. And I wanted to do something different this time. I wanted to do a farmhouse or a modern farmhouse style coffee and cocoa bar. So let's take an overall look and then we'll talk about each section. So here on the right side is the coffee side. We have our Keurig, which always stays here. Next to the Keurig, we have our two shelf unit, which is a DIY that I did last collaboration, um, the coffee beverage collaboration. On the top shelf is where I store my coffee cup. And this coffee cup came from Kirkland's. Kirkland's has a nice sale that was going on yesterday. And they have a beautiful uh, collection of black and white buffalo check uh, kitchen items. And they had pictures there, tablecloths, table runner, bowls and napkins. Uh, I don't think I've seen plates. Uh, but they had a beautiful miniature platter that I liked. It only had it had gold ring around it, so that wasn't going to work. But I purchased this beautiful coffee cup. I think it's just simply gorgeous. I love the simple design of it. It's about a 10 or 12 ounce cup, so it's the right size. And like here it is, the price there from about $5.99. I got it for about $4.19 during, during this sale yesterday. And on the bottom here is my Radon dessert plate that I am using as a coffee saucer. And also I use it as my snack or some sort of coffee cake that I might uh, indulge in on doing my coffee or tea breaks, I should say, because I don't drink coffee. So that's the top tier. The second tier is where I do my decorating or some sort of functional uh, decorating. And um, we have four, three more stacks of the dessert plates and also a recipe card. Now this recipe card is not just here for decorating, but it matches perfectly as the buffalo check around the card, but it also serves as a menu card for what meals I will be planning for next week. And this one here is the taco ring we'll be having next week. It's a delicious, simple dish. My husband loves it. And uh, if you're interested, let me know in the comments below. Um, and I will put it in the community page, the recipe. 
So it sits on a stand here and I just basically fills it up with cards that I'm going to be cooking for the, pre the next week. And I just sit it here because it, it looks nice and it also goes with the farmhouse style but it's also functional. Then we have a beautiful mini white tea roses here that kind of softens the space that wraps around the two-tier stand. It was this beautiful vine that softens the space beautifully. And I just love how this is put together. It's simple, it's gorgeous, and it really say modern farmhouse to me. Okay, so over on this side is where all the good stuff is. This is my cocoa side. We have this beautiful bird cage. This bird cage I purchased from AC Moore. It was a store that's now closed. Um, I don't think it's a one of those um, popular stores that's all over the United States, but I know it's here in Virginia. And this make a perfect storage for hot chocolate. As you can see, the K cups that's in here, and it has a nice little flip switch that you can lock it. And it stores all of my cake cups in there. This makes a beautiful storage for cake cups. And I put all of my hot chocolate uh, cake cups in here. And I thought it made a perfect, perfect way to store all of my hot chocolate for the bar. Then we come to the two-tier two stand. Now, you guys seen this, the last collaboration. On the top, we have our regular hot chocolate uh, powder and then we have right in these two containers are containers that I fill with yummy stuff that I can put inside of my hot chocolate these are quick melts they come in all kinds of flavors you can get them from uh, Amazon and basically they just little discs of chocolate with some of them have caramel, some have salted caramel, some has different pe peppermint uh, chocolate. But you just drop a couple inside your cup and it changed the flavor until something a lot more desirable. And then in here we have our marshmallows, of course. What's hot chocolate without marshmallows, right? I love these little houses. I purchased these houses from... TJ Maxx about three years ago and they for sugar and all of them say sugar. I purchased about four of them because they make great containers to hold your sugar in or to hold your seasonings like salt and pepper. Any kind of dry goods that you can put inside there to season your food or your cocoa bar. <laughs> then we have our Buffalo Check napkins that I rolled up in three and put a nice little tie in front and it just tilts on the side there just to add some interest to the cocoa bar and then of course we have another black and white plaque there that says family I love the vines that goes around the top here and has the tea roses in the vines there I think that is such a gorgeous addition to decorate then we come down to the second shelf so let's get closer so now we come down to the second shelf this cute little cow is a gorgeous little piece of kitchenware that you can store all kinds of things in toothpicks or like you see here my miniature spoons to stir my cocoa in. This is such a cute little cow. I, this is another purchase that I got from Kirkland's that was over in the Buffalo Check section. Very pretty. This was originally, I think it was $4.99. So I got it something like $3 or so. And I'm using it to store my little miniature spoons to stir my cocoa. I think this is such a cute little way to do that. Then we have some more Radon cups. This is a new addition called Gold Digger. I think that is so cute, very humorous. My husband think I was trying to tell him something, but that is not true. <laughs> and then the one back there you've seen before, this one says Mr. on it. I think I did a Radon haul not too long ago and uh, showed you some things that I purchased from 
TJ Maxx during that haul. If I can find that video, I will link it in the iCard above. Okay, so then we come over to the last section here. And this is where I put all the goody stuff. This is a beautiful uh, vignette of the Buffalo Check napkin that I like. But it's standing on one of these stands here that I have had for quite some time. They come in a set of three. I, it, it was given as a gift from my husband. I can't remember if it was from Grandin Road or Front Gate. Not sure. But they have them in all colors now. Then I put a nice dome to create a beautiful dessert stand where I can place all of my little goodies that I can have with my cocoa or my husband can have with his coffee. And then lastly, we come to this gorgeous picture. This is a black picture that I had for a number of years. I purchased this picture overseas in Russia. And I just topped it off with more of those beautiful vines and the white tea roses that kind of flow out. And the vines of the tea roses that follow right on the back there all the way up on the top shelf of the two-tier shelf there. And I think this is such a gorgeous way to display those roses inside this gorgeous black pitcher. Don't forget to check out my YouTube community page where you will find any changes to my scheduled programming, upcoming series and collaborations, or just to chat and say hello. If you love DIYs, decorating, organizing, and so much more, click the subscribe button and click the bell for new videos notification every week. Don't forget to visit my other social media platforms for ideas and tips to decorate, organize, or better your home living. Until the next time, my friends, smooches! Well, that would do it for this collaboration, my friends. Don't forget to enjoy the rest of the YouTube sisters in the playlist below and subscribe to their channel. I'm sure you're going to get some great inspiration and ideas for your coffee and beverage bar this season. Thank you, my sisters, for another fabulous collaboration. Can't wait to the next one. Love, hugs, and smooches. closing don't forget to check out the team that's the dream team queens we are a group of ladies who put together some beautiful collaborations for home decor and tablescapes for your enjoyment and inspiration i will list their channels below and here are their names here so go check out their channels and most of you probably are familiar with them and subscribe i know you won't be disappointed they are some very talented sisters mm -hmm.